Now, Martin, you have had a first date nightmare. Not only did you have a first date nightmare, you had it all over a very famous person. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Don't leave it there. What the right. hell? Okay, no, no, no. Basically, I was a massive fan of Simply Ready McHucknall. I had a poster of him up on my wall. And I'd met him at a premiere, and he got my number from my friend and called me up and invited me to go to the Nebworth concert to watch Oasis. That's nice. I was very nervous, couldn't eat, but kept drinking champagne, mixing with all these huge rock stars. And then we got into the car to go somewhere else after the concert, and all of a sudden, I got this sort of reflux, oh, and no. I went... Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> what way did you go again? <laughs> yeah. I went... <laughs> and I just went... <laughs> And literally slapped his dreadlock, so he went <laughs> like that. And the next thing I knew, he took me back to his and gave me a nice bacon sandwich and mm. looked after me, made me ring my mum to yeah. say that I was safe. For me, the moral of that story is every white man with dreadlocks deserves to be thrown up on. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>